Aber jetzt haben wir den Björn von In Flames. Björn, nice to you here. Can you hear me good or is it like... I can, I can kind of hear you, yeah, yeah. You can hear me? Yeah, kind of. Yeah. Although you should actually have some good ears because all of these years playing rock, you should be protecting your ears really good, I guess. Um, I actually, uh, I cheated a lot on that, so my hearing is not that good on that ear, but we'll make do. Okay, also gut. Er hört mich einigermaßen, es funktioniert. Und wir können jetzt natürlich auch über den grossen Headliner in Flames oder da. You are here as one of, the, one of the big headliners. How is that? Like, what does that mean to you? Uh, it's fantastic, obviously. We can bring our show. We can uh, do uh, some pyros and stuff that we always like to do. Uh, and we get to play a long set and that's always fun. Yeah, it's going to okay. be fun. And how has your festival season been so far? Uh, last week we did uh, Rock and Ring Rocking Park. Fantastic festivals as well. Not anywhere near as beautiful as this, but still, it was a very cool festival. Yeah. Although you are all out of Göteborg, I mean, you also have a really nice scenery where you're from. We don't really have these mountains, man. It's, uh, it's, it's gorgeous. But everybody really talks beautiful. about the mountains, but did you ever like think about climbing up the mountains? Yeah. Go like for a little hike? <laughs> we were talking about it earlier today. Our uh, assistant tour manager, he, uh, he said he saw one of these line ferries that go up to the mountain and he wanted to go, but I'm a little bit too lazy for that. You're a little bit too lazy for that. Yeah, so totally. what did you do all day? I watched bands. I watched We Are Harlot. Uh, I had some beers, played guitar, you know, had fun. Okay, also Eric Oxaiko. Sie sind jetzt da bei uh, uh, um, Greenfield Festival. Sie sind natürlich auch bisher schon am Rock am Ring, Rock im Park. Aber es ist nicht vergleichbar mit der ganzen Szenerie, die man da am Greenfield hat. Etwas, was den Bands definitiv auffallen tut, ist einfach da, wie wunderschön die Schweiz ist. Aber hey, sind wir ehrlich, in der Schweiz, Interlaken ist einfach auch ein gutes Beispiel, wo man kann vorangehen kann mit den schönen Bergen. Aber was oder was hindert ihn daran, jetzt mal überhaupt so einen Berg zu besteigen, weil wir ja schon oft davon reden, oder besser gesagt, mit der Seilbahn aufzufahren. Er hat gesagt, ja, yeah, liegt halt daran, dass ich vielleicht ein bisschen zu faul bin und jetzt nicht gerade auf eine grosse, eine grosse Wanderung möchte gehen, sondern lieber einfach da ein paar Bands zu schauen, wie die Band von We Are Harlots. Now, you'll be playing uh, on the, as the last band here at the Green Festival today, tonight, on the main stage, after Motorhead. Is there any time to watch Motorhead before? Oh yeah, we'll make time to watch Motorhead. It's it's an amazing live band. Um, I've seen them since, well, basically since I was a kid. So every opportunity we have, we try to see them. Hopefully we can be on stage today and watch it. Get really pumped up for our show. But do you also like go onto the festival area and watch them from there? Yeah, yeah, of course. It's also normally way better sound. And uh, you get to see everything. So I recommend it. It's, it's from, from the front, you need to see it. Yeah. Now people told me, but I'm not sure if you were also a part of that group, that In Flames are walking around now already. As you said before, you went to watch the live band We Are Harlot before. What do you do? Like, Do you also go and eat food from here or are you more like for food and for hanging around backstage? No, I, as I said, I really enjoy watching bands and especially from, from where it's supposed to be seen. Uh, so I, I walk around uh, most festivals actually and uh, you know, you bring a couple of friends, you meet friends. Uh, and you just have a beer and watch great music. Yeah. But do you also meet fans? Yeah, oh. of course. Yeah. And did they come up to you like, hey, Bjorn, Bjorn, oh, picture? People are so polite. Uh, it's never been a problem. So, so they, just, they just like look. No, they're, they're, I mean, if they want to have a picture, I have no problem with that, or an autograph or whatever. It's that's part of. It's the reason why we're here. So I, it would be dumb not to do it. Yeah. True. That's very nice. Well, well said. Also, Eric Saika, wie schon gesagt, sie sind da umenand und äh, tun einfach mal die ganze Festverstimmung ein bisschen aufschnappen. Und sie sind from die letzte Band, die da heute live werden spielen auf der Hauptbühne am heutigen Tag und das Ganze nach einem grossen, grossen Act Motorhead. Und äh, sie haben Motorhead schon mehrmals live gesehen und äh, gehen auch immer die Band go live schauen, so oft sie können. Und auch heute wieder, auch wenn es gerade unmittelbar danach dran sein wäre, wäre es irgendwie eine Möglichkeit finden, um nachher nachher Motorhead live zu sehen. Und ich glaube auch, dass wir sie live schauen können. I'm looking forward to watch Motorhead myself. Mm -hmm. And also stay watching In Flames, but I've never seen an In Flames concert before. Oh, you haven't? What oh. expects me when I go to watch In Flames? Because I have to be honest to you, it's not really my kind of music, but I'm interesting, interested to go a little bit in that direction myself, in listening to music. Um, I think uh, visually it will be uh, something I don't think you really have seen probably here. Uh, not to <laughs> boast too much, but it, it actually looks really impressive. Um, uh, it is, in the end, metal. What we do is metal. Uh, it's very melodic though, so... Like we can hear right yeah. now. <laughs> Now, yeah, look yeah, at that. Yeah, it's got mega loot, eh? That looks, up. <laughs> that looks pretty cool, actually, yeah. 
No, it is very melodic that what we do. So it's kind of accessible for everybody. So I think you'll enjoy parts of it. Also Or gut. maybe all of it. Ich hoffe, dass ich da ein paar Tipps können aufschnappen kann und mal irgendwann selber mit Metal kann umgehen kann. I mean, I think, what do the most bands start with when they start listening to metal? Like, Excuse what me? is like the first band, of course, without saying in flames, the first band you would say people should listen to if they want to start to listen to metal? Oh, I didn't hear the question. Sorry about that. Oh, sorry. It's a bit of a complicated question, but. <laughs> Now, like I asked you, I'm trying to like get into all the metal stuff, you know, and also like even more than that, like the hard rock, slipknot, metal kind of thing. And what would be the first band which you would say you've really got to see this band if you want to get into metal, without saying uh, In Flames, of course, because that would be the easiest answer. Well, it, I'd say some of the influences that we have, uh, that would be like Maiden, of course, Iron Maiden. Everybody's seen Maiden. It's always a great live band. Uh, and then if you want to. I mean, Slipknot is a good example too, because it's super extreme, but it's extremely dynamic. Uh, maybe not so melodic. Some of the choruses are very melodic, but uh, if you can handle Slayer, that's one of my favorite live bands too. Uh, that's a good way. In, yeah, that's a good way into metal. Very good way. And you have so many albums to explore. All right. Now I've got to ask you. When I look at your style right now. I'm not sure if it's going to be the style which you're going to go on stage as well. No. <laughs> is this your like Sunday outfit? This is seriously just my relaxed outfit. Relaxed yeah. outfit, yeah. also flip flops, flip -flops uh, yeah. uh, shorts, yeah. shorts <laughs> all is all is very gemütlich. Yeah. And as, uh, what is it? The South Bay uh, annual 1976. It's something I've found in my closet. So, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> something you found in closet yeah. when you went to look and have a look look uh, what's all around it. Yeah. What else would you find in your closet if you would go really really <laughs> deep? Uh, Somewhere, maybe some leggings, who knows? Uh, no, no, no. no. I'm kind of, there's a bunch of um, band shirts, obviously, uh, mostly from bands that we toured with and friends. Uh, it's not like I collect, but I have a lot of them now, so. I'm especially Motorhead, I guess. Oh yeah, I do have a couple of them, so yeah. Also, er hat ganz viel Motorheads, liebli will. Ich habe natürlich gefragt, hey, ihr seid ja richtig geile Melodic Metal Band und du bist da mit Shorts, mit einem schönen blauen Liebli und Flipflops. Es ist wahrscheinlich nicht so, dass du dann so nachher auf die Bühne gehst. Ja, er will nein, natürlich nicht, aber trotzdem, es ist das, was er im Schrank gefunden hat, ein bisschen zum Teil. Und es ist vor allem gemütlich. Und wir sind ehrlich, the sun is shining, it's wonderful weather. Why not wear flip-flops and shorts? That's why it's all a good thing. All right, in flames, thank you for being here and I wish you a wonderful, a wonderful concert, Björn. And have a good time. Rock the stage. Put on your uh, yeah, metal clothes, clothes, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and if you got time, go to check out some of the festival things which we've already done before. Mm -hmm. And of course, have a lot of fun with uh, Motorhead. Oh, I will. Thank All you. All right.